One of the most common problems I'll see in my clinic is someone who presents with trouble concentrating. Maybe somebody is having a difficult time concentrating on their schoolwork, on their work in general. Maybe it's trouble completing tasks at home. And so there are various problems or various mental health issues that can lead someone to have problems concentrating or focusing. Maybe most commonly that I see in a private practice setting for a psychiatrist is ADD or ADHD. And one of the hallmark findings of ADD or ADHD is trouble putting mental effort for a sustained period of time in tasks. And so people will tend to go from one task to another without completing a task. Maybe they'll have a hard time listening to people or have a hard time following directions. Uh, in the hyperactive type, maybe they can't sit, stay still. And so really the best treatment for something like this is stimulant medications. But ADD or ADHD is not the only thing that can cause problem concentrating. A clinical depressive disorder can have a symptom where someone has trouble concentrating. So if someone is lacking enjoyment in life or is feeling hopeless, sad frequently, maybe they feel worthless, one of the other symptoms they can feel is problems concentrating and it could just be so fatiguing or they may not have the energy or effort to put in the mental energy necessary to get tasks done or to complete tasks. So in this case, treating the depression will help with the concentration problem. Other mental health conditions that can cause problems with concentration are anxiety. Now anxiety is typically just a general like worries or feeling nervous, maybe it can affect sleep, energy can be low, like people can get fatigued. But one of the other symptoms that are associated with it are problems concentrating. And so in order to address this sort of problems concentrating, you have to address the underlying anxiety. Now there are other mood disorders that can come across as problems concentrating, and that's bipolar disorder. Bipolar disorder, people can get very happy or manic, this euphoric feeling. They may not need to sleep as much, have a lot of energy, but one of the symptoms they get can be easily distracted or very distractible. And so maybe that will make it difficult for them to focus or stay on tasks. And so treating the underlying bipolar disorder is gonna be a necessary step to help with the focus and concentration. Some other important characteristics to consider if someone is having trouble concentrating is one sleep. If someone is sleeping too much or too little, maybe they can affect their focus or concentration during the day. Also, if they have a sleep disorder, such as sleep apnea, that can make someone more fatigued during the day, that can make someone have a hard time focusing or concentrating or putting that mental effort necessary. And so having a sleep study, evaluating for sleep apnea, being compliant with the treatment if one is diagnosed with sleep apnea, there's going to be necessary steps to addressing the concentration problems in those cases. And there are several medical conditions and medications that can cause problems concentrating. Anemia can lead to anxiety, maybe fatigue that can affect someone's concentration. Thyroid problems can lead to depression or anxiety that may affect concentration. Medication side effects like maybe prednisone or steroids can contribute medications that are sedative or sedating. Maybe it decreases one's ability to put in that mental effort necessary to concentrate or focus. Those are just some of the basics. There's several other conditions or medications that can contribute. And there's just overall stress management. How does one handle stress? Do you take time to reflect, time for solitude and silence? Are you in touch with your spiritual life? And nutritional aspects as well. The more healthy foods one eats, the less psychological symptoms they'll have. But the more junk food, the more saturated fats, the more processed foods, the more psychological symptoms one's gonna have, like problems concentrating. So hopefully this helps clarify if you're having problems concentrating. There are several different reasons that can do it. One of the most common problems someone will present with in a psychiatric clinic.